Anthony, the silly, weird, and very messed up man, was enjoying himself very much as he went along his area. It was a wonderful day. Then he saw Thomas. Hello, Thomas, said Anthony. Aren't I a very amazing person? Uh, you're pretty decent, said Thomas, but, uh... But what, said Anthony? Out with it. There is another very amazing man that's coming to... Over here to join us. Who? Where? His name's Jose. He's a little far away, but he's going to be coming to join us. When? Oh, someday. And Thomas hurried away. Meanwhile, Jose was enjoying himself on his in his area. It isn't very long, and that made him feel a little sad. Then he saw the Curtis man. Everyone's been very kind, but my area is so short, and I do miss some good long runs. I think you should go and tell the boss people. I'm sure they'll understand, said Curtis. Jose soon found out that indeed he was right. You know what, Jose? I feel just the same way. Then he came back with exciting news. Guess what, Jose? The boss man I said we can go and the Dan man said we can go and visit his other workers in his area, and then it'll be a long run to get there. Oh, thank you, sighed Jose. They set off next day. By now, the other workers were all talking about Jose. He's a very amazing, ha funny, happy man. Did you know that? Anthony was beginning to get jealous. He may be happy and crazy, but I'm an amazing man too. Huh. Look, said Thomas. Why have they all come? There's no people's coming yet. But Thomas was wrong. They heard some screaming and whistling. Here he comes, said Eladio. Jose made his way and passed some of the people. I hope you'll meet Anthony too, said Luis. You both have great things about yourself. Then Jose set off to go and help out Scott, and they worked happily. Then Anthony arrived. Sorry, I can't talk. It's time for my last important job. Mustn't be late. He was hardly out of sight when the other people heard some shouting. Then came an alarm. Stop all things. A special, is it? I see. Anthony was getting impatient. Why are we waiting? We're being delayed. Sorry, Anthony. They're getting a special man to come and do a special job. Soon he could see Jose in the distance and he was carrying some supplies as he made his way. Well, bust my private parts, said Anthony. Next day he was still fuming. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this happened to me. What the heck, man? I'm sorry, said Jose, but I was a special. Why? The important man came just as you had left. He ordered a special thing. We had a splendid run, but, uh... But, finished Jose Anthony, it can be nervous when you don't know the area that well. Exactly, said Jose. You're such an expert. Anthony felt much better, and soon he was telling Jose all about his area.